Alright, here in the group stages in the Deathmatch World Cup 5, we've got Favourite on the Berbers up against Clean on Zoe Marido. It's the Italians. Oh, and he's fast on the quick wall there. Crazy fast on the quick walls. Oh, not quite then. And favourite is through, forcing a garrison quickly. And out come the pikes. Favourite's not going to be able to get anything on that side. Meanwhile, on the other side of the map, you can actually look to see how favourite defended against clean there. Mostly cavalry comp so far, transitioning to barracks. Well, clean barracks in a castle and walling himself in to start with. So he's going to delete the segments of walls. Later on, once he masses up enough, uh, pikes to actually really push out once one of these castles finish. So he finished the second castle and we'll see the fortified walls. Go down, I'm sure. Oh no, there is a little gap there, he doesn't even have to worry. So he can stream his units back. Fourth as he pleases. Start aggressively or defensively building. So he's going to get a castle here to try and protect the gold mine. Favourite. It's creeping forward with the castle and the workshop. So forcing his opponent to stack up so many builders on castles. Puts him behind on overall building. And then he's going to race out of third castle because now he's going to need to be able to defend against the military advantage that Favourite's got over him at the moment. Favourite's transitioning on the champions already. Already has a good number of cabs there while clean. They just got pikes for the moment. going to start switching to these genies crossbow bowmen as well as a whole bunch of workshops. Clean, adding some town centers around the back wall. Favorite. And we'll play a little bit more readily with his TC placement, protecting gold mines and whatnot. Favorite trying to force an engagement. Get clean to move out from under the castle if you can. Base building, range units, and Onigas now. Genies, crossbowmen, camel archers. Push here from Queen Favourite. Slight army size, and now it's like bill size advantage on him. He's gonna push out these caps into his base, but while this is going on, Queen's looking at trying to push forward with the Genie's crossbowman if he can, but it's all gone wrong for him. So, favorite. He can't really get an easy way into his opponent's base, there. He's now bringing everything back. Has lost quite a few of those crossbowmen. So he's going to try and remax through all this while favourite to the pop count he wants to be at, I think. The engagement going on now, and it does have the upper hand. In terms of the army size heading into this, and the slight bill lead as well. We go to snipe those Onigas, and it's going to be very rough. It's a nice shot for him, but. Clean, unfortunate, not to land another shot there on that uh, Camel Archer ball. But 
claim I want to defend against the very expensive Cavalier army there. Though he is at under 100 pop, while Favorite is maxed out on quite a mixed army still. He's got a lot of hussars in the mix, so he's starting to add a bit of trash. Favorite's eco behind this is starting to really leap forward over. Um, Cleans, but Clean is going to try and get on this gold mine. But he's going to lose a couple of bombard cannons for his troubles. So Favorite continually mounting the pressure here, and it's Clean's going to find it hard to really go for any aggression himself other than just trying to poke here with this comp that he's got. I mean, he's not really playing around any cavalry while his opponent is, so it's going to be very hard for him to, you know, snake units around a long way into his opponent's base. His opponent will see him for miles. Ooh, and this is very rough for clean. The villagers have that TC getting kicked off. Clean is trying to take an engagement here on favourite. He's killed. He's got all the hussars here. He's focusing down on the champions. Some nice control there, he's avoiding some of the Onigus shots. One of them lands there though. So you have to be careful to not let any more land. And the archers. Genie's crossbowmen too. Even range. And the archers seem to be a little bit stronger. Onigas hitting such a small unit, right? we get quite a lot of value with these but camel archers because they are a little bit bigger though, they seem to stack quite as well. Another raid going on here by Favourite and it's really restricting Clean's eco right now and he's on 61 bills to Favourite's 108 so he can afford to keep bleeding a little bit behind this as long as he can deny this gold mine completely. Like, I mean, he's losing units to get the raids, but if he's killing bills and he's denying gathering, forcing clean to gather inefficiently, you know, over stacking around places, um, it really plays into his favour here. He just seems to be in the driver's seat so far in this game. Clean sending some of his uh, genies cross bowmen to clean up these camels who are quite weak against them, it seems. Castle under a bit of threat now. Uh, take an engagement on the Genie's crossbowmen. He's looking down the champion numbers, but it's not quite enough, and with the range support, they've got to get the hell out of there, particularly with the Onigas in the mix. So they've got bombards to contend with, so these guys will be able to take some nice pot shots against the Onigas. Going down to a small number of crossbowmen there. No, Clean, not able to find a way into his opponent's base. Oh, if he had kept going there, he would have been able to cut off the stone. And meanwhile, he's had to come back a little bit to defend against Hussar aggression. So, favourite is just relentless. What can we say? He is the favourite. Attempt to keep. He's called the town belt, but he's going to send those villagers back out. Oh, and Clean's actually done it. He's wiped out Favorite's front line. Really impressive, but he needs to get these bombards in position and keep pushing and make sure he can protect them in the meanwhile. So, Clean, impressive defense. Favorite up to 108 hills, though. So he needs to be careful to not lose too much in the Onigas. Oh, that's a big hit. The Bombard's going to hightail it out of there. Big blow there. Genie's crossbowman count. 
the favorite still just seems to find more in the tank. And the fandom keep applying the pressure here. Azul. All these athletes need to get back to work for favorite right now. For a clean right now. And there's gonna be able to take down the Onaga. The crossbowman can't last under the castle fire there. Another Hussar raid right here for favorite. He's decided to widen the score gap. Clean seemed to really be snatching it back there when he wiped out a lot of the trebs. But it's not to be now. Looks like it's about to fall, but the uh, genie's crossbowman should be able to clean up this raid with win minimal difficulty because the Hussar don't really have any armor against them. They don't have the biggest of health pools for a melee cavalry unit. Now I'm going to have to retreat for now. Surrounding the genies, crossbowman with a bit of backup here. Clean. I think he's on the ropes a little bit here. My favourite. He's only got 96 fills of his own. Losing a couple of the gold miners there. My favourite's basically maxed out here, and he's on the, the wood line there. There's not much more. Wood at all, but safe for clean at the moment. He's only got here and all the way over here. And so this is really cutting into his eco. Favorites rating is really impressive. He's losing a couple of hussars, but it's definitely been worth it. He's forcing another engagement over here. Clean. Find a distance gather. There's gold here as best as he can because he's basically out of gold at the moment. He's been really hemmed in to his corner of the map. A few villagers there. Down to 54 bills to favourites 95. So favourite nearly maxed out and clean. 120 pop. Oh, and favourites now going to pinch the gold off clean over here on the right side of the map. going up by clean who's got 27 villagers building that one this one over here is under a lot of threat there's only one trap in here to try and defend this so he's only going to be able to pick off one of the other traps the castle goes down so he's bringing in genies crossbowman traps actually ignoring the castle in favour of I mean, knowing the trip's in favour of the other castle, and it's a bit of a costly mistake there to clean, because favourite just picks it off straight away. And GG. Favourite takes the game.